I think that I think that we shouldn't have had a general election on a single issue. I think that what we did, that we gave Boris Johnson power by allowing him to wrap himself up in the lie that he could get Brexit done by the end of January, because it won't be done. We will need to continue to negotiate a relationship with Europe. And what, obviously, we will be leaving at the end of January. And we, but, you know, getting Brexit done will also mean negotiating an ongoing relationship because 50% of our trade is with Europe. And frankly, there's another 40 trade agreements with the rest of the world that simply come from us being part of the European Union. And we're going to have to negotiate all of those as well. And he says that he can do it by the end of the year. Obviously, this is an ongoing issue that we're going to need to deal with. My point is this. Because we, because we agreed to a general election and because it was going to be a Brexit election, I think that was a mistake. I think that if we wanted to deal with a single, ele- single issue, we should, have said, we should have said, let's deal with that single issue by having a referendum. A general election is not a referendum. And we thought that we could change the subject. Do you still want to remain now after the election? Oh, I think that it's in Britain's interest to remain in the European Union, but we're leaving. So what do you do? I mean, I'm a practical, pragmatic politician. We're leaving at the end of January. So what's important now is that we ensure that we have a relationship with Europe that's going to work for jobs and the economy.